Welcome back to the Hank Strange Situation, Lifestyles of the Locked and Loaded. Make sure to check out HankStrange.com. You can sign up for our email list and find ways to follow and support our efforts. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Hank Strange. This is actually, we're doing this for you, Treon, now, Walt. If I, so, like, I keep falling behind the barrel there. Yeah, <laughs> it's hiding you. <laughs> Check it out. This is the Liberty Suppressors Leonidas Mark II. And what it is, is an integrally suppressed upper. It has a titanium core. Aero precision handguard. Yep. Um, we yeah. got a, a PSA lower that it's on. Got we have Devil this Dog. really cool Devil Dog Concept hard charger, as well as our uh, primary arms optic that we have on it. But anyway, integrally suppressed 300 blackout. Walter and I are going to check it out. I actually have the, the Mark 1 of this, or version 1 of it. And we're going to see is this better, cooler? quieter <laughs> all that kind of stuff kind of like a no air pro day out on the range with myself and walter from safety harbor firearms let's get all up into it right now right now all right walter so what do you think um me you and spence you've been out here shooting this um very quiet nice yeah. nice um as a shooter you hear more of this back here yeah than you action. do of this out here Shoot down at the berm, Spence, not at this. Down, steel down toward right the here. white thing, Spence. Down, down yeah. into the pocket. Yep. There you go, you're hitting it. There you go. Oh, wow. Yeah. Decent little group there. Yep. I'm just clamping it on. Ah, what is that? What happened? Nothing. Maybe it's the heat. Yeah, it's gonna get a little hot. There you go. Last shot? You're, oh, yeah. Last shot. There you go, you're good, yeah. Yeah, let it cool off. Excellent. That was Spoken. good. Woo! It gets hot. <laughs> yeah, from all the shooting. <laughs> all right, here we go. Use the charging handle to release it. See if I can hit that thing. I think I did, didn't I? There you go. Oh, you got a shot. <laughs> yeah, you're hitting the same spot. <laughs> Where'd that bottle go? That's it, you man. hit something down there, ricocheted. Yeah. <laughs> nice. I put a couple in the blue thing, put a couple in the brake uh, disc, and then the rest were in the white. Yeah. In the white propane thing. All right. Okay. Let's see how this is here. You <laughs> shot it in the ricka. <laughs> that was good. I heard it go, but it did that with you guys a couple times. Spencer said he heard something hit yeah. it. This is why if you're shooting at steel, it needs to be far away from you. Well, this is this stuff is hard as a rock. Yeah, yeah. So, so we've got it far away. I heard something hit that metal shelter. <laughs> yeah. Those subs aren't going through it. No? A lot of it, unless you hit the same oh. spot a couple times and tear it. Oh, it's not going through? Yeah, watch. Let me see. Like this one here. 
Oh yeah, they're bouncing off. The repeated hits, like where I shot it, it yeah. finally went through, but then, yeah. or you did, whoever did that, I mean Spencer started that, but these were friction staying off to the side, so. Yeah. I think this right here was me, I was shooting higher. Yeah. You know, I think Spencer's shooting at that one, so. And you were shooting at this one too, but a little bit here, lower. See, it just like, but ching, yeah, ching, ching, ching. Oh yeah. <laughs> Look at that, choo, yeah. Choo. That's why you heard those ricochets a couple yeah. times. So those subsonic bullets don't quite have the they don't have the oomph oh, yeah. to punch through to the steel. But that's how it is. Yeah. You know. Typically you're using the subs and you can see where I hit up the, close. <laughs> where I hit the disc, and then it just yeah. left the copper mark on that disc. It didn't really uh, yeah. it didn't knock a hard hole in it. Okay, Walter being a Eagle copper eye. spotting dog. <laughs> Where is it? Right here. Oh, there we go. There we go. Right there. Also. Yeah. So here's a couple of them. Let's actually, let's get some shade on it. So there you go. That's what's happening with those subsonic rounds coming down here and hitting, you know, this stuff, believe it or not, just the shape of it and the thickness and everything. Uh, for these propane canisters, right? That's all lending oh, yeah, to yeah. the effect of what we're getting out of that. So that's cool. Yeah, that is cool. Mm. I would As agree. you walk away and you get away from that, all you hear is thud in the dirt. Yeah. So it's very quiet. Yeah. I agree with that. Yeah. Really, uh, and, and accurate also. This whole setup. Yeah. Happens to be very accurate. Uh, yeah. We just tossed this optic on here. Uh, you guys might see somewhere in the video. Yeah. Someone, I won't mention who, didn't yeah. tighten that. Finger tight, <laughs> finger tight. <laughs> All right, so Walt is going to do a GI mag. Yeah. yeah it took it. Side charging. We're just going to shoot in the berm so you can hear the, yep. the suppressor. Wow. <laughs> do it again. <laughs> wow. wow. There's more, for me, uh -huh. there's more spring noise back here. Yeah. Then there is uh the Yeah, I'm stuff. just hearing that thud and the action. Like that. Yeah. Yeah, that's just the action and the thud. Oh. Okay. So. Go for it. it. Shoot whatever you want. You hear that? Yeah. Ooh. There we go. Yeah, GI mag worked well. No yeah. problem. All right. That's actually, speaking of GI, this is actually a Colt magazine. Colt. Hold on, let me see if I got it. Any, oh yeah. Anybody that gets it. You know, it is getting warm, Walt. It's not super warm. We're taking, we're taking breaks. And the weather's really nice out here. Oh, so. it's beautiful out there. A little windy, <laughs> but yeah. It's Lucky beautiful. for us. And uh, this Devil Dog Concepts, I like it, man. Yeah, it works well. Yeah. Does what it needs to do. All right, so I'm going to um, shoot at that berm a little bit. I want to see how it sounds behind the gun myself. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, I'm just hearing the action. I'm not even hearing the thud. Yeah, back here, you don't hear that spring noise. Yeah, so now I'm going to go for that upper canister. I think I'm... Here we go. Okay, I'm going to go for this one on the right. Okay, one Come thing... Loose. One thing I noticed... <laughs> oh, finger tight didn't work? <laughs> yeah, seriously, Walt! <laughs> You got to make this up. I'm like, why am I missing? <laughs> oh, yeah. What were you missing? <laughs> because the optic is not tight. <laughs> uh, there you, there go. you go, Walter. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> well, you know, uh, what do you want for fingers? Come on. Yeah. Your optic needs to be really, really, really tight. tight. Even tighter than this uh, for accuracy. That's important. <laughs> so here, with the handle, you just pull it all the way back towards you and let it go. Yep. No, pull it back. Just pull it back. No, pull it. Pull it nice and strong. There you go. Let it go. Boom. There you go. All right. getting 
hot. It's done. You need to was hitting right be... where you're aiming, right? Uh, ping, ping, yeah. ping, 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 one right after another. So, yeah. 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 So, just to, to give you guys the whole rundown on it, and of course, this magazine doesn't have anything in it. For all those folks out there who are worried about that, we'll give you the rundown. So, the Leonidas upper, you have to get that from Liberty Suppressors, right? So, they're putting that whole thing together for you, and it comes in, and then you can put it on your own lower. So for us, we, we use this uh, Palmetto State Armory lower that I've, man, I can't remember. I made this sometime last year. I put this together. I think myself and Patrick. Uh. Baby Fist P, who's also here on the Utreons. Exclusively Walt because... He, he got deleted. kicked off the YouTubes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so he's exclusively here. Hopefully he gets that YouTube channel back. Yeah. So we put this together. Really simple, you know, just your, your, your regular stuff, Magpul stock. And grip and all that kind of stuff on it and and um, and the upper came with a different charger but this is the hard charger so if you hold on to that Walt here I could show you guys you know see how that works it just goes on and if we what do you think about that no what do you it, think about the hard charger it, it works well I yeah. mean it, it's this one's designed for this side. They must, I don't. I don't know if they so, even can have another one because it might be in the way. The, the yeah, no, you're, you're the, left-handed. Would you prefer it over on the other side, or how does that work? I mean, I I adapt. It doesn't matter. I, right. If you're a lefty, you figure it all out. So yeah. But no, it works <laughs> well. It works well. It does. Yeah. Um, I like that. I prefer that even. I think one of the things that's wrong with an AR is this. You know, this back, back here. charging. Well, thing if you got a big ass scope in the back here, it's hard <laughs> to get a grab on it. Yeah. yeah. So. Um, so, um, yeah, I'm I mean, not knocking I, ARs for all the AR people yeah, out there. Yeah, Everything every, could be better. Yeah, well, you know. So, <laughs> but so that's cool. But I think you know when you put this together, this is a nice package. In uh, in my opinion, you could use this for like home defense. Sure. Oh, you know, yeah, 300 yeah. blackouts. Uh, if you're if you're going to be fighting real close up up close. Yeah. You Definitely know, be quiet. Close quarters. Yeah. yeah. You want to uh, like in your home and stuff like that. You want it to be quiet. Yep. and also effective now we were shooting down range here and we were shooting at some uh, what are the what, what are those propane tanks made of steel just steel yeah there's regular 20 pound propane tanks yeah. yeah so we did notice and you guys will hear that on the video <laughs> you heard some zinging and yeah. that's basically so we were shooting the uh, exclusively we shot the Fort Scott munitions 300 um, sub blackout sub yeah sub subsonic stuff uh, tumble on impact right and um, that, in a lot of cases, it did punch through sometimes. Eventually, it did after we hit the same spot a few times. Yeah. It pushed its way through, but right, uh, just hit by itself. It was doing that and kind yeah. of glancing off. So, and yeah. in my opinion, I don't know what yours is. That's you know, that's what you would expect with um, well, subs. With this kind with subs, subs and yeah, yeah, yeah so. all this. And then what it's shooting at. I think yeah. this stuff is mostly it's you can use it defensively and also for hunting. Yeah. So oh, yeah. just imagine this hitting a hog. Yeah, it definitely do the it do the business. Yeah, yeah, it do and, the and it's yeah. gonna bounce around. It's gonna tumble in there. Well, yeah, and it's around, gonna. So. And if you hit if you hit bone and things like that, this solid thing is gonna go through it. Yeah, it's not gonna deform before it gets through it. So right. Yeah. yeah. So uh, what would you use something like this for, Walt? I'm curious. Uh, well, I mean, I like that concept of the uh, if you got to use it in a an enclosed space with no ears on. Yeah. Um, which nine times out of ten in those situations you're not gonna have time to put ears on no so no. yeah you'll keep your senses about you with this yeah. quiet and concealment and that too so, yeah yeah um, exactly but yeah no that that home yeah. defense thing or hunting you know where you can hunt with a suppressor I mean right way way uh, way nicer so nice yeah yeah you know now you probably would want to put a little bit more on your gun like as we as we have it set up here I think it's good you know, this reticle, it doesn't like require, like if your um, battery's off or whatever, you could still use this yeah, reticle. Yeah, I, mean, I don't know if I could show you guys the particular reticle on this. Uh, I doubt no. it. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna spend my time, but it is the, uh, this is a PAC, PAC 2.5X uh, from Primary Arms. I've had that for a while. Yeah, that's the so. first time I ever looked through this and it's, mm -hmm. it's got a, the reticle's a round type thing with a post in the center and all that yeah, stuff. Yeah, really easy to use. Yeah, easy to use. Yeah, yeah. it worked really well. What I would suge suggest with this, I would say get a sling of some sort, and then obviously you want to put a light on this. You know, other than that, it's pretty. It's pretty good right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. 
this is what um, that's what that that round looked like you know it's uh, really good stuff uh, oh, yeah. Fort Scott's gonna be a little bit more expensive and well you know the <laughs> solid turn copper rounds I think. yeah that's life that's the way yeah. it is but yeah no it that's what I have this is what I have in my gun so my gun that I keep by the bed if something goes bump in the night actually is the Leonidas one so now what's going to happen with this after this goes through its paces this will this will replace that vault okay you know um i like having something like that when things go bump in the night well i, I'll, I call yeah. first dibs on your hand-me-downs uh -oh. <laughs> uh oh <laughs> yeah uh you and lola okay <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, but yeah that's that's that would be my purpose you guys can let us know out there what you would use it for uh what you think about this i know i've been getting some questions since you know it came out and people want to know like hey how is that thing I think it works really well. I think it's quieter than the previous one. We're not using like fancy test equipment. No, or anything, no, no. But it's yeah. definitely away from the spring and mechanism in here. It's 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 really quiet. Yeah. So yeah. Absolutely nice setup. Um, now it's going to be expensive because you're talking about an upper and an integrally suppressed upper, at all of that, you know. Um, well. So, you know. That's the way it is, right? Yeah, yeah. You, gotta you go want to, you it's want one to, tax stamp, though. You want the really cool stuff, then <laughs> they gotta pay a little yeah. extra. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So um, I'll run all of that in for you guys, so you can you know see all those things. I don't have those numbers. The lower is gonna be the cheap and easy part to do, yeah, I think. That's, yeah. And then whatever optic you want to have on it, if you want to have a red dot and all that. You could have a laser. You could have a yeah. light. You could have yeah. a can opener. You can have whatever <laughs> you want on the thing. Whatever you, you want. want. Yeah. Whatever you want. So. Um, big thanks. I want to thank everyone from Liberty for sending the upper. Of course, thanks to uh, Brownells actually sent us this hard... They're, they're under here somewhere. See that? Bureau of Propaganda. Yeah, you know. Bureau of Propaganda. So um, I want to thank those guys for sending that out. Of course, shout out to Palmetto State Armory and Fort Scott Munitions. We cannot forget about Walter of Safety the Harbor Crash Firearms. test dummy here. Coming. Yeah, absolutely. Coming in to <laughs> shoot with us. And Spence. And Spence is out here yeah. shooting as well. Uh, guess what? So Before we wrap this up, I want to remind everyone, we were talking about it a little bit. Yeah. We're going to be putting up these videos on on, on Utreon, Utreon because yeah. YouTube has like spent a lot of time harassing us poor innocent. I can innocent. touch my magazines on yeah. Patreon and stuff, yes. Yeah, uh, Babyface got his whole channel deleted. I I got like a um, bunch of videos deleted and then a uh, strike. So, and then for a while I couldn't even post. So what you guys will see is we'll be putting all the stuff here on Utreon. And if you want to, you can actually subscribe to our channels here because it works like Patreon in that you can subscribe and support your favorite content creators right, 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 right. and all that kind of stuff as well as it you know it's it's a content platform that you can look at videos on so i think they have some cool features they're working it out it's not perfect we're working we do the podcast on it all yeah, the time yeah yeah well you know i'm sure when youtube started it wasn't perfect either no so, no but they let us go live and hold guns. Yeah, touch guns, touch, yeah. We yeah. can actually do that on the yeah, yeah. podcast, which YouTube won't let you us do. You can say adult words <laughs> and stuff, too. Yeah. 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 And all of us are over here. Babyface is here. Walter is here for Safety Harbor Firearms. And, of course, we're here for Hank Strange and for Who Moved My Freedom. So make sure you check it out. Yep, yep. Any, any, any other messages you want to tell Support to the people? Support the alternatives. Yep. You know, you know. That's it. That's all you got. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> when they come, when they come for you. What are you gonna do when they what come you gonna for do? you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right, guys. Thanks for joining us right. here. We'll see you on the next one. We're out. Peace. Make sure to check out hamstrange.com. You can sign up for our email list and find ways to follow and support our efforts.